just wanted to do a video showing the absolute immorality and wickedness of the Jesuits and just what goes on inside the Jesuit order and everything and just how wicked they are. Supposedly for the Society of Jesus, um, they got a lot of immorality going on. So I got some articles here, uh, some of which are from Catholic sources. Here's one, it's about uh, more than 500 abuse victims fi uh, filed in Jesuit Oregon province bankruptcy case. You know, thank God they're going bankrupt, but, you know, so and this is from a Catholic news, news agency. As a bankrupt, the, and it's funny, because supposedly the Society of Jesus, if we're, following, if we're following the teachings of Jesus, okay, why is all this pedophilia going on? Ridiculous. Uh, verse of scripture I want to go to first, though, is Revelation 18.5. For her sins have reached unto heaven, and God hath remembered her iniquities. Uh, God remembers the iniquities of Roman Catholicism and, and the wicked Jesuits. Uh, read here. As a bankruptcy, bankruptcy case for the Society of Jesus, Oregon, Oregon province, I'm kind of tired right now, I'm not, not the best at reading, proceeds more than 500 people have bankrupt or have filed claims accusing the Jesuits of sexual abuse in the Northwest U.S. Plaintiffs include native Alaskan villagers abused as children and preparatory school students and the Spokane Sorry, spokesman review. Sorry, review uh, reports. Whew, I got to bed. I'm tired, but just wanted to wanted to do this video. Uh, had to had to get this out there. Uh, filing deadline November thirtieth. Going on there. But again, I mean, and, and it's funny. It happens at a preparatory school. You know, these Catholic schools are filled with this kind of stuff. Um, I'll we'll go to this one. So the Crooks, Crooks, another uh, Catholic website. New revelations hit on sex abuse, or new revelations hit sex abuse in Chile, Chilean church. So it's the Jesuit church, Roman Catholic church. Uh, uh, Rocio, Argentina. Just when you thought the situation in the Catholic church couldn't get any, couldn't get worse, new allegations of clerical abuse and its cover-up have hit the press. It's, it is also become clear that the crimes committed by one of Chile's once most beloved priests exceeded what was originally thought. Last year, Pope Francis made a 180-degree turn concerning sex abuse crisis, the sex abuse crisis in Chile. After originally defeat, defending a suspected bishop accusing sexual abuse victims of calam calamities, yeah, of course, for the Pope, you know, because they have to cover up their wickedness, he changed his mind after an investigation and accepted the resignation of several priests, including one whose appointment caused or whose appointment caused an op original uproar. Yeah. Uh, skimming through this thing. Jesuits, yeah, the storm in the recent months, the most influential Catholic priest in Sintangos said, said, said yeah. again, kind of tired right now, not good at reading. Get a little bit tired right now. Uh, modern history, the late Jesuit father, father, you know, calling call no man your father, you know, calling the, the priest father. Pretty blasphemous, but uh, Ren, Renteo, Ren, Renato, whatever, uh, Pablit, a Jesuit fell from his pedestal, you know, and he died in 2010. I mean, absolutely disgusting. Here's one from the Chicago Tribune. Jesuits hid sex crimes. Internal church records released on Tuesday show Chicago Jesuits continuously conceal, conceal the crimes convict of convicted sex offender Donald McGurry for more than 40 years and a prominent Roman Catholic priest who, sec, who uh, co co sorry, continued to sexually abuse do dozens of children around the globe. I mean, absolutely disgusting. And these are supposed to be the Society of Jesus, and they're hit, hiding this this wickedness. Yeah, the, the Jesuit order. The, I mean, the, I mean, you know the whole thing of the IHS, ISIS, Horus Set. Well, you know, uh, that's what they really worship. The the Trinity, the Trinity of the Jesuits. It's all. I mean, obviously the Trinity is false altogether. But the the the, uh, the uh, Trinity that Jesuits worship is not the Father, Son, Holy Ghost. It's ISIS, Horus Set, or Zeb, whatever you call it. That those that Egyptian Trinity. And it's funny because on this whole thing of the Trinity issue, uh, there are many pagan religions that have a Trinity too. Like the Babylonians, they have a Trinity. The Romans, the Greeks, they have they have a, a, a three-person God. You know, they have gods like that. The Celts, you know, all this stuff. Pagan religions have their own three-person Trinities. Uh, one letter in 1970. All right, I'll skim through this. So yeah, so they're hiding this this wickedness from the Jesuit priests. Jesuits made choices time and time again to trade woeful indifference. Uh, scrolling down. 
I'm sorry, I, again, I'm just kind of tired. I'm just skimming through some of this stuff. Jesuits, list of 50 priests. 50 priests accused of sexual abuse uh, includes seven who worked at Cheveris High. Yeah, never, never, never put your kids in a Catholic high school or Catholic school in general. Uh, two men named by the regional governing body of the Catholic order were accused of abuse that occurred during their time at the high school in Portland. And obviously this is kind of a... Uh, it's actually this is, Jan this is about a year ago, January 15, 2019. Uh, so, uh, seven former teachers uh, and administrators at administrators at Cheveris, Chever whatever High School in Portland were on a list of 50 credibly accused priests made public by a governing body of Jesuits for all northeast states, including Maine. Uh, they released by USA North Province of Jesuits or Northeast Province of Jesuits. Uh, was the latest of a series of moves towards transparency by the religious order of Catholics. Yeah, it, it's all a f facade, you know. Because, the, again, in reality, the Jesuit order, I mean, again, look at this. The Jesuits, they, they hid the crimes. The Jesuit order is very wicked. They are they are very satanic. Um, a religious order of Catholics, commonly associated with education. You know, they're actually, they're, the thing is, the Jesuits are actually a military order. That's the thing. They, they were originally started to counteract the Reformation and bring the Protestants back to Rome, which they already have done. Most Protestants are just, just Roman Catholic light, pretty much. Uh, skipping through some of the stuff. At least eight, and this is obviously back in 2018, but I'm just bringing this out to show just the, again, the absolute morality. I mean, what does the scripture say? For God hath remembered her iniquities. At least eight Wisconsin priests are on Jesuit's latest list of accused abusers. At least eight Catholic priests with ties to Wisconsin are among those identified on Monday with the ongoing effort by the Jesuit religious order to make public the names of the priests and brothers with brothers hmm, with credible allegations of sex abuse on minors with uh, and uh, vulnerable adults. You know, and again, them releasing it is just a, a facade because the Jesuits, they're, they're just as wicked in many ways. Um, where is it? So I'm just, again, I'm just skimming through some of this stuff. And here's another one, Chicago Tribune again. 18 Chicago area Jesuit priests named in the new list alleging sexual abuse. 18 Jesuit priests. Uh, this, I, next time, I think next time I won't do videos so late at night. Or, or this time at night. Uh, 18 Jesuit priests with ties to Chicago area institutions were named on the list released Monday alleging instances of sexual abuse dating back more than six decades, including one defrocked priest who was convicted of sex crimes in federal court. The North, the Midwest province Jesuits are part of a Catholic religious order known for its focus on education. Yeah, they're also a military order, military order as well. They killed JFK, by the way. I uh, released a list of dozens of priests with credible allegations of sexual abuse on, uh, to their names since 1955. And the last article I'm going to go is Maryland Jesuits for the list of 30 men. 30 men. 30. Credibly accused of sexual abuse of children. Uh, the Maryland province... Oh, yeah, actually, that was in the last article. Yeah. Or, you know, no, sorry. Yeah. So I got mixed up. Sorry, again, I'm just tired. Uh, the Maryland province of Jesuits on Monday released a, a list of about 30 priests and under and other order members who have been credibly accused of sexually abusing children since 1950. 1950. It goes back all the way then. And by the way, the, this this kind of wickedness in the Catholic Church, it goes all the way back to like since the beginning of the Catholic Church. Because it, because it's a corrupt tree, and a corrupt tree only brings forth corrupt fruit. You can you got Matthew chapter 7 verse 15 talks about that. Matthew 7 15, uh, Matthew chapter 7, sorry, talks about how a corrupt tree can only bring forth Actually, let me, let me just show you the verse actually. Uh, Matthew chapter 7, verse 15 to 20. Beware of false prophets which come to you in sheep's clothing, but inwardly they are ravening wolves. Verse 16, you shall know them by their fruits. Do men gather grapes of thorns or figs of thistles? Verse 17, uh, even so every tree bringeth forth good fruit, but a corrupt tree bring forth, bringeth forth evil fruit. Verse 18, a good tree cannot bring forth good fruit, neither can a corrupt tree bring forth good fruit. Verse 19, every tree that bringeth forth not good fruit is hewn down and cast into the fire. Verse 20, wherefore by their fruits you shall know them. The Jesuit order is a corrupt tree and it brings forth only corrupt fruit. That's why it's all this wickedness and, and sexual perversion and pedophilia and homosexuality, all this other stuff is going on in the Catholic priesthood. 
because it's a corrupt tree and it's only bringing forth corrupt fruit. I'm not going to read this, but uh, I just wanted to show you guys this. This is just the wickedness of the Jesuit order. How just how wicked they are and how how much how much uh, the the corrupt fruit they're producing. So don't be deceived by Roman Catholicism and don't be deceived by this wicked Jesuit order. God bless you. Goodbye.